Max, there are so many things I want to say to you today to express how much you mean to me, but I'm having a hard time coming up with the words to describe it. But I feel it when you squeeze my hand and when you're excited about something, when you wrap your arms around my shoulders and kiss my cheek. I've felt it since we met at the Badger Herald, when I would catch you glancing my way during meetings. I felt it when I came to visit you in Charlotte for the first time and you brought flowers to the airport. I felt it when you took my hand in Charleston and asked me to marry you. And I remember growing up in Jersey, wondering where in the world was the girl I could one day call my wife. I fell in love with a girl who was born in California, the beautiful daughter of a proud Navy pilot and a kind-hearted Canadian mother. She called Minnesota home and thankfully transferred to Madison, finding her way to me in that crunchy Badger Herald office. My heart raced as soon as you walked in and it hasn't stopped racing since. And you are the woman I have always dreamed of. The person who makes everything right in my world. I'm so incredibly lucky and I won't ever forget that. And I feel it in this day, we have so much love surrounding us. It feels like my heart is glowing. Thank you for always making me feel so loved beyond words. You flood my dark days with light. You are my favorite. I love, love, love you. Man. On behalf of the Rivels and the Hensons, I welcome you all to this wonderful celebration. <laughs> now speaking of my racing heart, it's about to jump out of my chest. I can't wait to finally see you in that white dress and marry you. I love you and I'm forever yours, Max. <laughs> Anne, you are my love, my companion forever. With all of my heart, I promise to cherish you, protect you, support you, and devote myself to you as we build our life and our family together. Max, my love, my personal North Star, I promise to believe in our marriage with the same unwavering confidence you have always possessed when it comes to our love. I vow to speak when words are needed and share the silence when they're not. I promise to always choose you without pause, without doubt, in a heartbeat. I vow to always keep you laughing, both with me and at me, for the rest of our days. I'll be by your side through all that we encounter. I remember a few years ago when he first told me about Anne, and I could tell he really liked her. And for me, visiting you last year made it very clear to me how perfect you are for each other. I think I speak for all of us here tonight when we say we feel so fortunate to watch your story begin. Cheers to a very wonderful adventure. More importantly, thanks for being a great friend to us and also taking great care of our friend Max. I, along with Dave and Ricky and everyone else in here, wish you guys a lifetime of joy and great memories together. May the peace and happiness of this day always be with you.